Okay, defenseman, let's look at some of these one-on-ones. Now, this player here is leaving the zone, and our D is already out of here. We have a D way over here. He's already gone, so that's not good. If we break the ice up, uh, we'd like to have our D somewhere in here uh, to tighten up the gap and slow this guy down. You can see here, RD is almost waiting. He's had to stand still, so he's not moving. He's not moving much because he's so far back. Uh, he can get a little closer and have to skate a little. Look, he's waiting. Now he's starting to skate. All right, so he's skating here. This has become a better gap. Now the forward has slowed down a little bit, trying to uh, trying to get you to lunge at him. And you can see right here, you do. Uh, right here, you got to remember, at this point here, you haven't lost anything. He's now going wide. And he's trying to get behind you. He's trying to get over here. This is where he's trying to get. And you don't have to attack him like you're about to. You can see you stepping. Look, now you're skating forward. He's got to jump on you now. With Now he's picking up his speed. He's going to try to beat you wide. So instead of angling him off over this way, you've decided to come right at him here. And, uh, and good forwards are going to smoke you. I mean, this is Wes. He's a nice little forward, and he's getting better. But he's not certainly anyone from Regis that we might face. And so you can see right here, now you just realized, you can see how bad of an angle this is. Watch, you're coming at this angle, and then right here you realize, uh-oh, I'm in trouble. So now you've turned your angle to that, and now you've turned it even to that, because <coughs> he's has you smoked, and Wes isn't even that fast. So that's where you have to not lunge and come at him. You make the poor choice here, and this has happened too. The reason you're like this is because you haven't been moving because of the bad gap way over here. So if you're, at, if you're a little closer here and skating with him, he's got a choice to make. He'll probably cut wide here. You can just keep, you can just keep skating with him and coming this way with him. Keep going backwards and angle him off to the wall. So if, this, if right here, right here he decides to go wide, if you just kept skating backwards and kept pushing him wide, you should be, I would assume you'd be right about here with your stick on the inside here, keeping him to the outside. All the way here, you would you'd be you'd be a little in front of him here, and you'd be able to take him into the corner over here in just a minute, and uh, probably put him into this wall over here. Instead, now you can see uh, if he attacked this triangle well, he'd probably beat you to the inside and have a breakaway, all because of a bad gap, and you lunge right there, right here. You decide you go from skating backwards to lunging at him, and that's what we want to avoid. Hopefully, that helps.